Yeah. Was, can you even go anywhere? <laughs> like, why, why, what, it's like there's so many people that I've got to... Those dandelions. Prefer it. Oh, totally in season. <laughs> They're so bad, they make me sneeze. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I, you know, I've, do, I've been doing all right. I had horrible allergies, but yeah, uh, but not not to dandelions. So I'll way. leave some Allegra outside the door tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna take some with me on my way out if you don't mind. You know, no, they'll be fine. Okay, so everybody's been talking about it. The new album. Mm-hmm. I'm. Are you sick of talking about it? Are you? I mean, you're so proud. You gotta be so proud of this thing. I mean, that's impressive, dude. Super impressive. Yeah. No, I is take a good drink. <sighs> You've got a problem. No, uh, yeah, I, uh, yeah, no, it's been crazy. This, of course, we've been talking to, we've been talking to a, a ton of. <laughs> we've been um, talking to a ton of people out we here. We can't miss one word. Uh, it's yeah, it's another. I'm super. I, this has been another piece of the, of the big narrative of, of Greta Van Fleet in the narrative. I know, and I, I think we all can't wait for this virtual world to come alive. Yeah. Like, well, that's going to be a thing, right? Someday? Who's well, working it, on that? It would like, have to be. Let's do this. We're working on that. Okay. Yeah. The- kind of conceptual, a lot of our stuff, you know? It's, it is kind of an extension of the previous album, you know, uh, Anthem of the Peaceful Army. It's that same kind of world. It's that same kind of universe with those. It, but we wanted to create a platform. You know, it's, it's sort of mythological and it's mm-hmm. sort of ancient sort of mm-hmm. elements came so in. So cool. The thing. And but, you guys got all this new merch. Like weird yeah. merch, Wears. which is fun. Is fun. Like people are like, I got my robe. I got my robe. I got my candle. I'm like, oh my gosh, look at all this weird stuff they're selling. How fun! Well, that's that, the, the robe is totally Sam. He just walks around in bathrobes yeah. all the time anyway. So it was like, well, naturally, that's appropriate. Yeah, so just, yeah, that's cool. That, yeah. Well, it's it's a huge hit, and I haven't talked to a single even like this and compare you to anybody else. You know what I mean? Like, because we've heard that before. <coughs> yes. People yes. trying to make their little, like, sounds like this. It just seems to flow, and I don't know what th- what process we even have, you know? <laughs> so people are like, so what's your Tequila. process? Tequila! <laughs> well, that's a big part. It's a big part of the <laughs> Proving that over and over again. It's just in you guys, which is so oh, you. organic. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you're... Like those crunchy vegetable people, you know, it's just so, it comes so naturally to you. And some of us are like, give me the cheesecake. Um, but anyways, okay, that's a different thing. Not quite I, like that. <laughs> you can something with that. Uh, so what you. Do I, what do I do if I need a refill? Do I ring a bell? Yeah. <laughs> Is there a bell? We, do we have a. Someone? Hey, mom. Uh, oh, right. mom's here. Mom's here. Do, is that all I have to do? That's what you do. Well, a jet usually it's kind of, hey, mom, it's, it's met with, you know. Uh, Refill. You know, it's not, no, it's usually, you know, Uh-oh. you can do it yourself. Where is this? Which is Where my is impersonation, that? actually. Yeah. yeah, you know what? Actually, speaking of your mom, she's been on this channel quite a bit, mm-hmm. like a lot. And uh, I've watched all of the interviews. You've watched them all? Uh, While well, you're taking a poop in the bathroom? <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> well, that was it. That... We, we all, I mean, what was it? There was a. Oh, here we go. Here she, waitress. I, I think I might. I think I might need another. Thank you. Thank you for. Oh, uh, what a sweet mama. Well, so I think she's probably being so nice because she knows I'm about to make sure that you know all the childhood stories she's told us oh. on this channel uh-huh. and several times i've gotten just enough drinks down her for her to <laughs> re-impersonate how she used to call you guys like or when she would be mad at you and she'd be yeah. like joshua you might have a butler around. uh-huh i don't know uh not 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 anywhere anybody want to be the butler <laughs> Comment below if you'd yeah, like to be the butler. That would be good. We, we need a butler, you know. Karen's getting, she's not getting any younger. Right she, <laughs> she can't be doing this. She's going to break her back, you know? It's Poor like, Karen. Yeah, but usually it would be like, you know. Well, uh, get around! One, yeah, you know? <laughs> one of our favorite stories is about you and your brother uh, switching places, and someone got a lava lamp with all their school points. And the other one didn't know that oh, he had yeah. no points left. Yeah. <laughs> Do you remember stealing all your brother's points? Jake needs to understand psych- <laughs> psychedelia. He needs a lesson in the far and beyond. Sometimes he's too earthly. Is he? 
Yeah. Too bad. Yeah. Well, did you guys switch it's places not a lot? Too bad. Yeah, we we did. We, did you? Yeah. Well, we we learned in in early grade school it would have been like kindergarten that we could do that. Yeah. And then and then once we learned we could do that, we would keep doing it, and it would just make an ordinary school day a lot more interesting. Well, hello. You know. Hello. School can be kind of boring. Well, it can be. Yeah. It can be super boring. He's making notes. Oh, you here know? comes your butler. Aww. Oh, thank you. Thank you I'm very sorry, much. I don't have a tip. Uh, I have matches over here. <laughs> Bahabule. Thank you, Mama. She's so wonderful. Yes, thank you, Mama. Well. So this is going well. <laughs> fantastic, you know. Just a couple more of these and we won't be able to talk anyways. <laughs> no, it's going to be gibberish. <laughs> Nobody's going to understand a thing we're saying. It'll be, it'll be insane. And she gave us hours, stuff. you know. That, well, she... <laughs> she allowed us hours. She let you Everybody out. She let you out of the barn door, you know, so you yeah. gotta... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you gotta give her some kudos for that. Yep. Especially you two, Jesus. Oh, my God. Two at once. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> and you have no idea. <sighs> she was in for... Uh... Here she comes. <laughs> We're try- and you can't Someone, keep her out if we're talking about this stuff. Someone passed in the first day. Pass- first was day? It? Oh, it was the first day. day. Kindergarten, uh, Marianne Ackerman, who was the principal, I talked to her before they started, and she said, I've done lots of twins, had, had a lot of twins come through. You keep them together. They'll separate by first, second grade. The one is change. She called me at the end of the first oh my gosh. half day and said, I think I might have misled you. <laughs> <laughs> this is how this, this is not it's working. It's not going to work that way with these two because oh they control the whole classroom. She said she observed, and the teacher was trying to do all the things that you do to redirect, and and they just and it started in daycare when they were no, like no, eight or nine you, months old. We knew all of their tricks, you know. We're up to our own thing, and we just did our own thing. But Obviously, it, I, we were never in another class together until late middle school. Really? Yeah, like uh, seventh grade or something. Oh my gosh. It was that they long knew that. Romania all That's the just time. how it goes. Yeah, I suppose. Oh. Well, your mom has told us several times you guys started, you know, get, like the performance world was very natural from young. Mm-hmm. Very young. And we actually did uh, Younger. <laughs> Come old, on now. Old hag now. Come on now. Comedy's a rough. Oh, I love it. Could be, it could be good. Okay, city council, here I come. <laughs> All I ask is that we get very, very creative. Yeah, we can do that. Yeah. We good. well, yeah, we will definitely need your input. Yeah, great minds think alike, but we all don't seem to be here. <laughs> no. <laughs> we, we don't all seem to be local. <laughs> no, no. No, that'd be cool. Oh, cool. Ah, how fun. So the uh, there's a lot of people. On- Greta Van Fleet is a business. Yeah. You know, you uh, you got to generate money. Like, that's the whole thing. I know you guys aren't in it for the fame. I know you're not in it for the money. No. But no. see how smart they are? Do you guys see this? Do you see how smart they are? Learn they, that in school. <laughs> 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 Marianne, that's for you. <laughs> Almost didn't get that one down. Oh my God, ah. <laughs> Melissa! It's warm in here. Oh. Turn on the fan. Yeah, butler. Okay. Where's, yeah. Where's the butler? The comedy fairies. Oh, that's so funny. Well, you know what? Speaking of comedy fairies, let's just go there before I forget. So there's this wonderful show out called Marvelous Mrs. Maisel, mm-hmm. and it, I've watched it, of course, loyally through. It's arrested off stage one time talking about childbirth mm. because that was like illegal for women to talk about. Yeah, I've seen some. Of yeah. The shows. So then there's a there's an episode released and it is her getting her first big break and her first big break comes from this big famous band and they are going to let her be the opener. And of course, then people are blowing up my phone and they're like, well, it's not going to be a play to be such a good match. Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. So of course I sent it to your mom and just so she knows, you know, <laughs> and, uh, thankfully I didn't have your manager's email yet then. <laughs> and then, uh, <laughs> and then two weeks later you're on SNL with her. She's yeah. the host. Mm-hmm. And and then I was her. I think in some way they, I think in some way they they must, you know. I mean, yeah. Is this something you've heard? Is this a rumor you've heard? In the uh, closed rooms where people talk about business? Yeah. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay. 
<laughs> the heat is on. <laughs> no, actually, I've talked about this with a couple of my comedy friends that have been in the business for years and years and years. And they're yeah. like, Melissa, you don't understand what you're asking for. That's a terrible job. And I'm like, why? What do you mean it's a terrible job? I know them. I adore them. I love their music. They're like, no, no, no. No one's there to see you. Everyone's <laughs> there to see them. Like, it's a terrible audience. And I was like, Damn. Aaron, just so you know. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> I mean, I know they have all the control, but you got to bring it up. I'm just saying. Um, but no, that. I, so I've interviewed a lot of your fans. You're like hardcore fans that go ever could be if they could appeal to a mass like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Do you it, know you do that? Well, yeah, we see it in the audience. It's it is incredible. Um, I mean, it must be weird when like. 75 year old Gertrude throws her bra on the stage. That... <laughs> She's not the only one. <laughs> oh, no. they still make them in tan. Okay, great. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's a fine science, really. Yeah, uh, it is. It's perfect. It's great. No, but that's it. No, it's one of the most rewarding things. Everybody. Yeah. You know, yeah. there and, and, uh, and, incredible we as in me and your mom i just enjoy <laughs> talking with her when she her her passion and yeah. love for what you guys are doing is so inspiring and like i, I didn't get my voice from my father that's for sure you know you the impersonation i did of her earlier you know that uh, yeah, yeah that, that bit <laughs> it translated and then i suppose uh suppose it uh I evolved or man, let's go it manifested into something else. But yeah, that was it. I want to be a mom. I, I mean, besides all the trouble you guys got <laughs> yeah. in, like yeah. I'll probably I probably spank more than your mom did. But <laughs> I don't know about that. She did, uh, she claims she spanked you guys, but I don't know. <laughs> there was four of us, you know. I don't know how she did it. Some we I don't know. <laughs> we are transplants to Frankenmuth. Although my comedy business has always been here, we've just in the last couple of years, moved to Frankenmuth, and we lived out on a bunch of property. Now we kind of live in town. And um, mm -hmm. I've had to get rides from your mom and from Lori back to my house, <laughs> and there's been young gentlemen in my driveway peeing right to the main <laughs> road in Frankenmuth. Nice. And they laugh because they have boys. They think it's hilarious. All the time. All the time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Uh, okay, so. She said it was funny. She he, said it was funny. He is funny. I'm actually quite intimidated to open for them because he's going to come out and blow me out of the water. I've, I've got <laughs> Wait, I'm supposed to be the funny one. I've got obscure wit. You're, yeah, you're much I'm... more dynamic. <laughs> oh, that would be fun. I think we should. <laughs> yeah. Poor thing. We had a New Year's Eve together. Yeah. That was... And, and then so courageously, boldly, bravely, you guys release an album during a pandemic mm -hmm. that just kills. <laughs> like, I just don't, no bands have the balls to do that. I mean, were you worried? Yeah, I think there are probably a couple. You know? Well, maybe. But weren't you, weren't you worried? Like, isn't that part of selling an album is touring with it and, and going out? And I've <laughs> said it a hundred times. Like, that they, they are such genuine people. I'm, I don't just say that to say it. it. It's for real. It's so for real. You guys... You guys do something to people that I don't know that you even understand. I mean, there. Do you know how many people are walking this earth with tattoos of your face on their body? How crazy is that? Well, the first time ever, I was in Nashville, and uh, and you know we were. That was a real thing. <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't know how you live without red meat. I don't know how to do that. I think I would. <laughs> but uh, I think it would just be interesting to get your blindly get your taste test. Sure. But yeah, no, I think uh, before we check out the label, it would be interesting to hear your take on it. Okay. Oh. Some of your fans have actually had this beer. <laughs> I am I am actually holding it at a really good angle, aren't I? That's really good. You're, it's like we planned it. Yeah, it's kind of um, yeah. There's some unique uh, unique. Uh, there's some unique um, elements to that. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I have no idea what kind of beer this would be. It's like all over the board. Like you can't well, yeah, put it in like, a no, category. I, not necessarily. I mean, I should be able to. I'm not like the greatest beer. It's ancient. This is really very, very modern though, because there's a lot of interesting things going on there that are not. 
Huh. Not something that I've changed in other views. That's yeah. why I can't really place it, you know? Boy, that is so interesting that you would say that. Pull it <laughs> pull it out of that koozie. What? Pull that beer out of that koozie. No. Check it out. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what? It's a Greta Van Fleet beer. Well, that was an appropriate answer. Yeah. <laughs> wow, you weirdly described that. that kind of tra- well. kind of translates. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's quite good. This is some fancy thing. Yeah. Who's who's had it? I know oh, a bunch of you had guys it? have had it. Remember our garden see, skate beer? Send a couple invoices. Well, <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, no, that was uh, we did a, a like release it. party for I you guys. I haven't had this. Karen, yeah. Karen's gonna bring it up and she's gonna make sure he asks when he gets here. But you never asked, so I snuck one in here. Label and... here it is. <laughs> no, it's an amber ale. That's, that's the thing. No, it's kind of indiscernible. No, it's really good. We, and we're working on it. Just give it some time. We're working on it. Hopefully it'll become a staple in I our town. It. We'll be Greta Van Fleet beer will be the new black label <laughs> of Frank Muth. <laughs> more than a dollar a can though, just so you know. Way more. <laughs> She's actually coming on board. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Wait till we get she, the street. Yeah, we're we gonna can. crack a we'll we'll tap a barrel the night we name your street. Oh, that'll be so fun! Oh, I think there's. I think this is a new party. I'm very excited I just, about. I think there's quite a. Uh, what else? What else do we need to talk about? Do we talk about everything? I don't know. Do you? I could do, do this do forever with you, but I also want to like drink off camera with you guys. That would <laughs> be that's when correct. we talk about real stuff. We've been in the hot seats, <laughs> you and I, for a bit. Yeah, now. we have been. I don't um, know. It's quite, I, you know what? I know. I, really I know. To... I know. One last thing. Yeah. The front man of the band. Uh, the front man, the voice, the no, guy. Oh, oh. The guy. So you're, wow. you're the guy. Um, yeah, I've actually, heard... I kind of am, so I do everything, you know. <laughs> I do all of it, all of the stuff in the band, me. So, you know that now. You heard it here. <laughs> it's fact. This is media. It's fact. And Melissa Hager TV is a big deal. It's a big deal. I have hundreds of fans. <laughs> We're going to break the internet, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> break it. I'm fine with Forcefully. that. Forcefully. I will not be pl- mm-hmm. Sorry to the other boys. Hopefully they won't watch this. Um, <laughs> they the f- probably will. Uh, you guys watch. do a No, they all think they're your type. <laughs> they all do. They're, well, no, there's they all Danny think that. girls and Sammy girls and Jake girls and oh, I don't know. Mm-hmm. Oh, everybody's on. Everybody there. thinks that, and they're just like I hear. I watch comments and I'll, like your guys' music videos and stuff. I enjoy that because I I have so much fun listening to the video and then reading the comments. Is like, oh, did you see what he's wearing? I would wear that as my- give their left leg to clean your toilets. There's no, I mean, this it's like I've there's so many people that are. I mean, Jake, I can't even talk. I mean, there's so many thoughts mm-hmm. in my head right now. <laughs> <laughs> no, that that is super. So cool. I don't really know, but it's it's actually well. So since people know that we've hung out personally, people have asked me about what your type is, and this is my okay. favorite answer because I've always gotten along with you so well, mm-hmm. and I have said this numerous numerous times. I'm like, I think everybody's his type. He loves everybody. I do. Like, you yes. really genuinely love everybody. Yeah, I do. Every really, human. I and really I feel the same way. Like, I feel like I'm your aunt. <laughs> like, I'm old. I'm, kind of. I'm not quite as old as your parents, but I'm definitely not your guys' age. So, like, just call me Aunt Mel. We'll just leave it there. But I've always felt from you specifically, like, a gen- genuine love for humanity. That well. It's the thing. <laughs> what? <laughs> don't don't, don't uh, get onto the... Yeah, no. Uh, the, uh, then we'll uh, <laughs> stop the record button. Uh-huh, yeah, let's let's punch it. <laughs> let's punch it. Well, say something to your fans. Tell your fans something. Fuck fear. <laughs> Live your legend through the intelligence of love. Oh. That's what I Joshua. have to say. Joshua. That's very important. Oh, my God, that was good. <laughs> was it? That was really good. <laughs> oh, cool. <laughs> Gotta uncurl my toes this is the second day. It yeah, was good. I'm no, family. It is important mm-hmm. that people understand that, and that gets overlooked so constant, so so constantly. Um, yeah, and that's okay. being had <laughs> by me, ladies, by me. <laughs> <laughs> on the tour bus on the way to our next gig. Mm. Wouldn't that be? Fun? That would be super fun. You heard it here, Aaron. Uh, <laughs> Uh, whoa! We'll be back again. Thank you so much for tuning in. What a great treat. I told you guys it was going to happen. So now the next step, we all know what it is. Uh, it's going to happen. 
Thank you so much. I appreciate you. I appreciate your parents and I appreciate